What up fam? Today we get our survival on by making and cooking with a tin can stove. Stay tuned. For this build, I'm using this 12 ounce soup can, though you can definitely use a larger one if you'd like. Now, because there's gonna be fire in here, we wanna start by making some vent holes all along the top and the bottom of the can. Using a Sharpie, I mark where I wanted those vents to go. You don't have to do this, I just wanted to make sure they were spaced out evenly. Now, using this church key style can opener, I move all along the bottom of the rim, punching out the holes that I marked. These are gonna allow a constant flow of air to help feed the fire. Then, I do the same around the top rim to help keep the smoke from choking out the fire by giving it a place to go. This is also gonna allow more oxygen into the mix and keep everything burning. These pointed little crown pieces here can now be bent over so all the sharp edges are neatly tucked away. And by bending them just to the lip of the can here, you're gonna provide a slightly raised surface for your cook pot to sit on. Again, providing just a little bit more airflow. And just like that, our stove is made. So let's go outside and give it a try. For fuel, I gathered a bit of birch bark to get the fire going. And to keep it going, I gathered a whole bunch of twigs of various sizes. Once everything's placed inside of the stove, I ignite the fuel through one of the bottom vent holes. And in no time, a pretty strong little fire was just happily blazing in the can. Which is great, cause I am hungry and chicken soup is on the menu. From here, this little guy works just like any other stove, bringing my soup up to a nice simmer in just a few minutes. All right fam, I hope you enjoyed this project. I'm gonna go have some lunch. In the meantime, keep leveling up, you.